Over the years, we've seen hundreds of Smiths give it their all in our forge. Hi, my name is Tyler Reinhardt. I am 19 years old. I'm a sophomore here at the School of Mines. So one thing I really like to do is recreating historical blades. If I remember correctly, I got into this because I saw the Forge and Fire competition. And first thing I ever did actually was go out to our fire pit and chuck a piece of steel in there, but that did not work out. <laughs> It was pretty rough at first, but I eventually got to the point where I was pretty competent and obviously I was able to get onto the show. It's a lot more uh, stressful than it looks, and it looks stressful. <laughs> so. Normally at home I take a lot of time to clean off my billet on the second welding pass, but here I'm under a time limit. Ooh. Oh no. As I'm forging my blade, I find a second bubble. Basically, I just sent an email. I, I, I looked up forged in fire casting, and there was an email listed. I just sent them one. They're like, hey, you want to do an interview? I had to show them some stuff I made, show them videos of me working. I reflux it and forge weld it again. As far as I can tell, I think it has been fixed. Hopefully, this doesn't come back to bite me. I really hope Tyler can pull this off. And when I learned they had a forge on campus where students could use it, I was really drawn to that because that meant I could continue doing my hobby there. I know I can't simply cut it off, then I wouldn't have any steel left. So I use a chisel to open up the air pocket. As far as the, the blacksmithing club goes, there's a lot of opportunity to basically do your own thing in terms of uh, a creative hobby. That's the one thing I think is really special. All the professors I've met, they're all, uh, they're all really supportive of this kind of stuff. I have a straight blade and it has hardened, so I'm gonna start grinding. This is the moment of truth for Tyler. I am planning on being on the next team and uh, we're uh, we're working on our plan for what we're going to do, uh, but yeah, we're going to try and go even bigger and better this time. Well, amazingly enough, Tyler's managed to draw that he blade out. Yeah, man. I want to make sure to heat my blade very evenly. I'm looking for a nice dull red color. Tyler quenched. All right, Tyler, that's a success story. <laughs>